That smell when we were coming under the bridge is like a mixture of tidal muck and, and wastewater treatment plant smell. And it's become so familiar to me that I almost like it. There's hardly a place I haven't been in this little boat in New York. So now we're coming into the um, Dutch Kills. At low tide, this looks like just like a muddy bank. The Dutch Kills separates the northern tip of Randall's Island with the Bronx, and it's only navigable at high tide, which is right exactly about now. You know, sometimes it doesn't look like much, like you can see this bank has a lot of trash and debris along it. I don't know, I've sort of learned to appreciate that stuff too. I'm, I'm kind of having second thoughts about going through here. There's a lot of tide coming through that stretch. I'm just not confident about being able to stick close enough to the bank. Well, this is kind of unexpected, but it seems like we're actually going into the current rather than with it now. It's like whitewater rafting in New York. Now try to paddle hard, Carolina. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do it. I mean, I know we're doing a lot of paddling today, but you can really, the tide can really propel you all around the city. I don't know, it's just such a different encounter with the city that everybody's so used to.